this far, a criminal so maniacal. You drive me. So deranged. I drive me. That the only way to drive the depths of his depravity. I drive me so hard. Is to travel to the limit of a serial killer's mind. I can smell your calc! He's already integrated six women, and he's found his next mark. <laughs> you find Lopital Lecter, and you'll find your answers. <laughs> Dr. L'Hopital, my name is Clary Starling. I was wondering if I could ask you a few questions. You're one of Miss Hines' kids, aren't you? Yes, that's right. Would you mind if I could see your credentials, please? Closer. Closer. I can see here that you're about to graduate in a week. You're not a real college student, are you, Agent Starling? No, uh, I'm just in Cal KP, but I'm training to go to CU next year. Miss Hines sent me a high school student, eh? Tell me, what did Trick say to you in the cell? next over. He hissed at you. What did he say? He said, I can smell your calc. I see. I myself cannot. You use a TI-89 and you worked on unit circle problems this morning, didn't you? Did you do all those problems, Doctor? Yes. That is a vertical asymptotic equation from the Larson Hostetler Edwards calculus text of the 8th edition. All those limits from memory, sir? Memory, Agent Starling, is all I have. Instead of a view. <laughs> you want to lend us that view on these equations, Doctor? Miss Hine must be pretty busy sending a member of the student body to solve one of her equations. She must be trying to catch that binomial bill from the newspapers. Tell me, why do they call him Binomial Bill? The equations he worked with back in Kansas, he used to factor them into two different segments. Why do you think he factors his equations? He likes to simplify his first derivative before he sets it equal to zero. You think you can dissect me with your simple banter, Agent Starling? You with your backpack and the chew marks on your pencils? Why, I can tell that you're only a year away from Algebra 2. You, sitting in Mr. Grace's class, sporting his cargo shorts, Dreaming of getting out and making your way to the Calc A-B. You think you're high and mighty with your trick functions and your anti-derivatives? A uh, Mr. Leader tried to test me once. I solved his limit with some fava beans and a nice candy. does this whenever it's told. I can derive an equation, or do a remount sum, but I can't do a U substitution. It puts C in the equation or else it gets the hose again. It gets the hose, but it gets the hose.
Now, it places the C in the equation. It places C in the equation. <laughs> okay, okay. If you just give me partial credit, I'll finish the paper. But I don't know you have to do shit. It puts a function C in the equation.